He was shot on the job in Wasika more than a year ago. Now, Officer Eric Matson and his wife Megan are talking to us about that night for the first time. Thanks for watching WCCO 4 News and CBSN Minnesota. Eric Matson was just named the 2020 Police Officer of the Year by the Minnesota Chiefs of Police Association. Tomorrow at the Wasika County Fairgrounds, there will be a Matson Strong benefit to raise money for his recovery. A recovery that our Aaron Hassanzada learned is far from over. It's the knock on the door that law enforcement families fear. For Megan Madsen, it came on January 6th of last year. She looked at me, grabbed me, and said, Eric's been shot, and it's bad. Megan, was it a fear that you had, or was it something that you never even thought about? I had actually had nightmares about it three times prior. Eric doesn't remember being shot. He found out 11 days later when he came out of his coma. My first memory is Megan waking me up in the hospital and saying, you got shot last night at work. And I like sat up and I was like, what, are you kidding me? Okay, he's not dead. There is a chance that he can make it through this. But it wasn't going to be easy. Multiple surgeries and three months in the hospital were just the start. Um, my life was completely different. I knew it was going to be a long uphill journey from that moment on. So then we start this whole new journey of rehab. I couldn't even sit up at the time because my core was too weak. Eric was equivalent to a three-year-old child. It's the easiest way to say it. So we're relearning what? How to walk, how to talk, how to do everything. How to, how to drink liquid. The progress was really slow, so it was frustrating. Eric spent months rehabbing in Nebraska, away from his wife and two girls during the pandemic. But from the moment Megan showed up at the hospital that first night, she realized they weren't in it alone. There was at least 150 cops, DNR officers, state patrol officers, city cops, county sheriffs. The family for the thin blue line immediately struck me. The other day I came home and had that parade, that was insane. From store signs to jersey patches, flags, and blue lights left on just for Eric, Matson Strong became much more than a hashtag or catchphrase. It's a mindset and a symbol of strength. What does it mean to be Matson Strong? To not give up on each other. Just keep prevailing and persevering. Aaron Hassanzada. And give each other grace. WCCO 4 News. Tomorrow's Matson Strong Benefit in Mosica will have bingo, a silent auction, and raffles. It starts at 10 and it will last all day. We have details on that and the Matson Strong bill. It is proposing tougher sentencing rules for attempted murder charges of law enforcement professionals. That's all at WCCO.com on our website.